My name is Ben Russell and I am a comedian, an actor and friend. Um, I recently got diagnosed with ADHD that I've had since I was a child, but uh, never did anything about it. And it's really not that difficult to take the first steps. But in your mind, you put hurdles up. You know, maybe not now. I don't have time. I can't be bothered. I gotta work, I gotta do this, I, you know, I gotta go to a doctor, I gotta travel, I don't have a car. There's so many different excuses that you can do. Trust me, I'm very good at it. But you will be amazed at how easy it is to see a professional to get help on this. And you will be amazed at what happens after as well. You could be living in hard mode, but you don't have to. Life was better because I could maintain focus for more than half an hour before going and watching two to three hours of YouTube videos. So I got more work done. Uh, well, they do say that you mourn for the person that you could have been had you been diagnosed earlier. Um, because, surprise, surprise, not great in school. Um, and so they do say that you go through a sort of a, a period of coming to terms with this. And there's something about putting a label on something, about identifying something, that then you can then do something about it. And it feels, it felt like a, a weight had been lifted up. Once you can identify this thing that you've been living with, it becomes much more manageable. If we have a problem with our lungs, say with asthma, we take medication for that, and we, we treat that. However, when it comes to the brain, we're somehow freaked out by this organ that is just another organ. Um, so I, to, to myself, it sort of demystified it a little bit. It's just another organ that you need to take care of and you need to see the doctor about. I directly, after I've been talking to friends about it and I've had three friends go, I'm gonna do something about this too, since Ben did it. If Ben can do it, I can do it. So from that, it has spread and I've seen my friends go and see people and see psychiatrists and see psychologists about things. It really does take just a friend doing something about it and talking about it to maybe spark something that might change in one's, and it's really not that difficult to take the first steps.